Hello, I'm Uncle Jerry. So glad to see you. <laughs> Hello, I'm Grandma Yvette. So glad to see you too. <laughs> uh, sorry, this is a toddler song, by the way. Uh, happy day. Monday. Home vlog. It's a Monday. Is it Monday? Yeah, happy Monday. Monday. Happy Monday, everybody. Yeah. We are preparing for a hurricane. Hurricane mm. Ialda. Idalia. 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 Okay. I've only ever seen it like written out. I didn't know how to pronounce it. Yeah, Idalia. Okay. Idalia. E. So e we right Idalia. Idalia. So Idalia. we thought that it was going to just be a category one, like no big deal. And then we thought, oh, it's going to be a category two. They upgraded it to category two, not not like as not a huge deal, but a bigger deal. And now it's going to be a category three. Yeah. Which is like the time where you should start worrying. Also, uh, for those of you all that are near Tampa. Talking about a once in a lifetime storm surge if it's if this hurricane oh. hits during high tide. Oh my gosh. They're talking four to seven feet. Is so it's supposed to hit like in the middle of the night, is that high tide? I don't know, it changes every day. Oh, okay. So I don't know. Oh my gosh, I didn't even think about that. But yeah, the highest it's been in Tampa is like four point six feet. So in Tampa Bay. Um oh. they're talking four to seven feet here? Wow. Not here. In no, Tampa. in Tampa Bay. Yeah. So just to give you guys an idea, like Depending on how far above sea level you are, that's what we're talking. Feet above sea level. And so we are at sea level. Florida's literally like we're at sea level. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. So, which is there's really no high ground. Right. Like, <laughs> which is scary. Right. We're good because we're in the center of the state. So like when we say at sea level, we're like 50 feet above sea level. Which is still so like, like nothing comparatively like, yeah. compared to like other states. Yeah. We're, we might as well be in the ocean. Right. If a tsunami comes, it'll wipe across the entire state. Oh, 100%. Let's so, not we don't have to talk about we'll that. Let's talk about that. <laughs> yeah. But we will not see a storm surge from the hurricane, but we will get a lot of rain and some wind. Yeah. So So what are we, we're preparing for the hurricane today because it is going to hit on Wednesday, no, Tuesday, Tuesday night, night, Wednesday morning. Right. I always get that confused. So Tim's got some stuff he's doing tomorrow if the weather's okay, but today we're going to be at home just kind of preparing the house. We just got all this work done to the backyard, so I'm very concerned about, we planted new palm tree, a new palm tree, it was moved and then they planted a new one. So that's not like, the roots aren't in. Right. So we're not sure how that's gonna pan out. And then we have this whole new structure. I don't know what's gonna happen. Should be fine. It is engineered to withstand a hurricane, Yeah. but you never, you never know. know. Yeah. So we're gonna start like bringing the furniture and stuff in. We'll do that a little bit later, but what are we doing right now? We're going to go to the store yeah. and not get water because we already have that. Mm -hmm. But if they have some, I might pick up another case. <laughs> um, get some food for the baby. Yeah. So just in case we can't like prepare our fresh food, if we don't have power, we should have power though, because we do have that battery backup, mm -hmm. which I feel like we'll show you that today because we've gotten a few questions about that. Right. They want to know like what kind it is. Because a lot of people think we got the Tesla Powerwall. Right. And but from we what I've heard, the Tesla Powerwall does not last very long it has had a lot of troubles well i read about some people that during the last hurricane their power wall didn't even work right and that's what i'm saying like, yeah i was like oh bad luck we need to have ours working yeah especially work. yes yeah so we'll show you that a little bit later as well but we're just going to run and get some food for the baby just in case he is at stage one feeding so we're doing like one ingredient you know like that whole thing yeah so we're gonna go grab that and we're also going to go to the library and get jackson we're going to take, take his library books and get him some new ones right because he's read them all a million times with him being in school we usually go to the library during the week now that he's in school and we have so much going on on the weekends we haven't had a chance to go to the library right so we're gonna go we're gonna pick him pick him out some books yeah i'm gonna find some hot wheels books Ooh, do you think they have that why not it's the library oh that's true it's got yeah. everything right. it's like a just to take a look it's in a book it's kind of like stefan from snl it's like this library has everything yeah, it's got Hot Wheels books, <laughs> books about uh, cats being better than dogs. Oh, it, do it does. <laughs> he has one of those. And about a witch that actually goes to a fairy school. Oh, is that a book he got? Yeah. Oh, it's no. Wanda's first day. Mm, look at that. So let's go. Let's go do it. So it's from inside the car because that's easier for me to like get the view of it. This is the Fortress Power E-Vault Max. This is our battery backup for the whole house. And when the power is out, it runs this panel. But at night, it runs the full panel. So this panel just has like the majority of our essential items in it. So like our, our outlets, our refrigerator, our hot water heater, and this panel has everything else in it 
So like I said, at night, it drains down pretty quickly because it's running the air conditioner and everything, but then the solar powers it back up. So the solar charges it and then it runs this if the power goes out, if it loses power from the grid. So that's why we should be good. And that's like our internet and stuff like that is on there too. But there it is, the Evolt Max Fortress Power. This is an 18 kilowatt battery. Oh yeah, see? Here in Florida, we're getting ready. I had no idea that C-3PO and R2-D2 had such a long lasting relationship and they bore themselves children, not only children, but also grandchildren. I'm proud of them. What are their names? What are R2-D2 and C-3PO's grandchildren's names? We're just commenting how there's like random things about like Taylor Swift has a whole magazine and Madonna has a whole magazine. And then we saw Perlock Holmes cat puzzles. Itty bitty kitty mysteries. For feline fanatics. Look at him. He looks very dapper. So does this mean that there are cat murderers? Oh no. Why is he, they shouldn't, this, don't promote cat smoking. Right? Also, don't <laughs> promote cat murder. But I guess if the cats are going to do some murdering, they just need to and read this book. <laughs> what? What? Why is this in the checkout at the... Okay. Believe it or not, <laughs> I'm walking on air. We just returned an Echo Pop. Oh, do you guys remember when I'll link the last home vlog or the last, the one before the last home vlog where Tim was trying to figure out a way to have the music face the pool and face the seating area and like the grill and stuff. So we bought a, a speaker. Yeah. It didn't work. Didn't work because, <laughs> so here's the thing, an Echo Dot will let you connect to multiple Bluetooth speakers. An Echo Pop will not. Mm. The Echo Dot's about twice as much as the Pop, but maybe on Prime Day it'll be cheap. Well, I decided, I'm like, do we really need that? I do. I don't. I need it in my bones. I feel like Tim, when he thinks that he needs something, he like needs it. Yeah. He like has to buy it. I'm just not that way. Mm, I am. <laughs> it's um, usually like a $50 Amazon speaker. I'm glad that one of us, not both of us, is that way. Mm. But now we are headed over to... So we ran to the grocery store. Um, we showed you a little bit of that. And then we're leaving the UPS store now, which I feel like we have kind of like a, a friendship with our UPS lady. I think like so. She like yeah. knows who we are because <laughs> we're She's in like, there all the time. Well, look at these idiots. <laughs> but now... We're headed over to the library because we need to get Jackson's books. So let's let's go over to the library. Let's do it. The library. Library. I know. I keep saying. <laughs> let's go to that lying berry. We'll be right back. But while we're driving over there, let me show you my little haul that I got from Publix. My little Sharpie pen haul. I got these. Look how fun these are. Paper Mate handwriting pencils. Oh, are these like for kids? I think they're for everybody. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, they're for me now. They're for 39 year old ladies. So this is a mechanical pencil. Check it out. But they look like regular pencils with like regular erasers. Oh, yeah. How fun. And they're fun bright colors. And you get five of them. You know what you could do with those pencils? What? You could solve a apostery. What was the name of it? A what? A mystery, but for cats. Oh. <laughs> what is it? Was it a postery? No. What was it? It was a puzzle. It was a puzzle. puzzle. You could solve some puzzles. <laughs> I sure could. And then I'll learn how to murder people. What? <laughs> But there's that. So I got these cool pencils. Oh, you can mix and match the erasers. I know. I'm so excited. I love these. I don't know why this brought me so much joy, but it really did. Mm. And so uh, I also got uh, some very fine, ultra fine uh, Sharpies. And they're like not normal fine. They're ultra. They're, they're, it's a cool pen. And then I got these fine, but they, they're clickable sharpies so there you go so the reason why i got the sharpies was because now that jackson's in school we have to write his name on everything like every single thing that he brings to school has to have his name on it and so i realized that i needed like little tiny sharpies to write his name on like little tags of like his stuffed animals for nap time and to write his name on like his nap bag and and all that stuff and we we only had one and it's kind of on its last leg so these are going to be for that but I just thought that was exciting because they're clickable. And then these are just for me for fun because when you turn 39, congratulations, you have a favorite pencil now. Because sometimes when you see stuff, you get in your mind that you have to have it. Oh <laughs> no. Okay. Memory card just filled up. Oh yeah, sorry. So. <laughs> That's why the last clip was like, um, but yeah, now I'm turning into you. 
Why? Oh, because, because you're I buying need... stuff. <laughs> yeah. You know what that means? That's like a free a free thing for me to buy something. No, you already. That's the thing is the things that I want to buy. Those pencils were literally like two dollars and fifty cents. The stuff you want to buy is like way more expensive than like two dollars and fifty cents. But now we are at the library, so I'm not going to bring this big camera into the library, but. Well, if we film anything, it'll be on the phone. We'll show you guys. Basically, we're just going to be looking for books. Yeah, but I want to get, like, books about... Because he loves Hot Wheels, so we want to try to find books about Hot Wheels if we can. Or just, like, cars in general. Cars? I want to find books about school. He likes to read about, like, kids going to school. Like, how to make friends and stuff like that. He's yeah. made friends at school. He has. It's so cute. Which is He fun. comes home and he's like... He's like, so-and-so taught me this at school. And, like, so-and-so, <laughs> we played on the playground and we did this. And One he's... kid taught him how to, like, tie his shoes together. <laughs> and I don't know if this was, like, a nice thing to teach him or if it was just, like, a prank he played on him. I don't know. He goes, look at look what I can do. And I was like, why are you doing that? And he goes, because so-and-so showed me how to do it. And I'm like, why? <laughs> um, but he thought it was really funny. So, so yeah, we're going to head in and look for, um, for books for Jackson. Yeah. And he's so excited because they're going to all be like a surprise for him. So it'll be right. really cool. And then if we like, well, it'll also give us something to do during the storm. So we might get some extra books Ooh. because we'll have a lot of time. I think funny thing is what when we say extra books right now, it's like 15 books. Yeah. So maybe we'll get 20 books, 20 books. Yeah. That's how many books he reads a week. Yeah. I mean, he would read he more. He reads three a night. Yeah. I think he would read more if we got him. Yeah. He just, you know. We say read. We read them to him. He's not reading <laughs> age yet. No, but he's very, he's interested in reading. So yeah, I think. He knows some words. Yeah. Like he can read some words. His sight words. Yeah. yeah. Okay. But let's head into the library. done at the library and I said hey guys like how many books has Jackson read and they're like <laughs> and they're like 455 books which is like pretty wild that's how many we've checked out on his library card but we I was reading a, a like statistics on how many books he should be reading before kindergarten they recommend that kids read a thousand books before kindergarten not that they they actually like literally read them but that they are read a thousand books before kindergarten He's almost halfway there. Right? Which is so wild. He's only three and a half. Three and three quarters, I feel like. That's what you gotta do. Yeah. You gotta get into the library. That's a, it's a selection for well, you to choose from. And I know we talk about the library a lot, but it is so, like, I think we just really are big proponents of, like, go to the library. Yeah. There's so We even got a free craft to take home, and it's all, like, STEM activities. It's all free. Yeah. So, and they don't even charge you for missing your, your return date. So like there's no fee there's literally yeah, no like, fees. Yeah, automatically up your return date. We got twenty four books today. Yes. So that's plenty for him. He reads three a night, so that'll last him a while. And if we read more during the hurricane, yeah. Even better. I'm super yeah. excited to see what he thinks of all the books. All right, it's the next morning. It's the next day. <laughs> so today is the day that the hurricane is supposed to come tonight. Like early tomorrow morning tonight. So now we sing. What? Let's get down to business <laughs> to get ready for wind. The battery died on the camera, but we're back. So we're on the G7X right now. I'm kind of curious to see, this is the G7X camera. Mark II. Mark, yeah, I'm curious to see how this audio sounds compared to, we've been having some audio issues. I know you guys know we've been talking about it kind of a lot, but I'm in my mind, I'm like, oh, the G7X is like the best audio. Right. For a little camera. Right. For a little, for a little camera. camera. Yeah, yeah. Um, but also, like, I feel like I probably look kind of, like, pale, right? Yeah, the color is a little bit. I'd have to color grade, like, no. everything. So it's a little bit more work that way. I don't know. Well, I, haven't, I didn't, like, brush my hair to this morning. <laughs> That's okay. Because you know what I'm doing today? You're going to Disney to check on hurricane prep. So See Hurricane Ialda. Idalia. Idalia. I keep wanting to say Ialda, and that's not the name. It's Idalia, which is actually a really pretty name. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, for, 
for, for destruction. I know. So you're gonna go to the parks. You're gonna see what Disney's doing for hurricane prep. This is something we've done before. As of right now, they're open yeah. on Wednesday. Yeah, they haven't closed, but I think, um, so the Tampa parks have said they're closing. Right, because like, they're closer to the actual, like, in, like... The path. What's it called? Like, landfall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, um, who knows? Maybe Disney's not going to do anything. They might not, because it will... Uh, so, yesterday, when I was like, ah, uh, this is, like, not going to be very good, I'm kind of concerned about this storm, mm -hmm. it was, like, coming in at a Category 3, like, near Tampa. Overnight, shifted a little bit west. I think that's the thing about hurricanes. So it's like, there's tons of different natural natural disasters, right? So it's like earthquakes and, and uh, tornadoes and all these other things, which hurricanes you can track. That's one thing with like, as opposed to these other things, at least you can see a hurricane coming. Right. But the thing that you can't predict with a hurricane is like where it's actually gonna go, like where the actual pinpoint yeah. line is. Up until like right before. Yeah. So you just kind of have to prepare for the worst. Right. Always. So like yesterday, I was thinking we were going to get more of a like hurricane force winds. Mm -hmm. Whereas today, it's looking like we're going to get more tropical storm force winds. I'm still going to prep the yard though. Yeah. So there's some, you're going to do that with me today while Tim is at the parks and then you'll see his park day probably in the next video. Right. So this is kind of like a, you know, we're splitting up. We're doing, we're not splitting up. Well, no. We're staying together. <laughs> we're staying together. We are just... <laughs> Uh, dividing and conquering. Okay, that's better. That's a better that's word. Better. Um, one time we put up a video. So we used to use HelloFresh for our like, this is sorry, sidetrack, but we used to use HelloFresh for our um, subscription meal service. And they started to become like horrible. Like the food was coming in kind of like rotten already. They would be missing stuff. I had to call like every single time and say, this happened, this happened. Till finally they're like, we can't give you any more credits. And I'm like, but the food isn't here. Right. So like, it's not me, it's you. So I had to, we had to break up with HelloFresh. I had to literally be like, it's not me, it's you. We're right. not using your service anymore. And so I put in the video because we had been in talking. The title. Yeah, in the title. And I didn't even think about this, but I put in the title, we're breaking up with HelloFresh. Or like, here's why we're breaking up with HelloFresh. But YouTube cut off. You can only see like a portion of the title before you click on it. And people thought that we were breaking it up. It just said, here's why we're breaking up or we're breaking up. Yeah. And I like, didn't even people, so many people were like, oh my God, I thought you guys were broken up. And I was like, why? I didn't realize that they couldn't see the whole title. And I was like, oh my gosh, no, I'm so sorry. That's not what's happening. Right. <laughs> it's just hello fresh. Right. Um, so anyway, so that was a tangent. A tangent. Uh, but I am going to, you're going to come with me outside. We're going to pick up some yard stuff. We're going to, we're going to get some things out of the, the, the way in case the winds, you know, are a little bit stronger. Yeah. So I just, I don't, I don't want like projectiles. Right. That's my whole thing. Right now we're looking at like 25 to 45 mile an hour winds. Yeah. Not terrible. No. But. Still don't want to have things <clears throat> outside that could fly up into like our new screen and stuff. Right. Or like windows, you know? Yeah. So. Doing a little bit of cleaning up. Yeah, but Tim's gonna go to Magic Kingdom and check out the prep there, and then you'll be here with me. If there is even any prep happening. Yeah, so what if there's nothing going on? What are you gonna do? I'm just gonna ride rides. Oh, okay. And just do it to it, baby. <laughs> That's hurricanes, baby. <laughs> All right, we did it. Here it is. I got Jackson's mattress. <gasps> Look at that. Look how big it is. His big boy bed is here. Right? It's a full-size bed. We did need a box spring, you guys were right. But yeah, we got a um, a pretty good deal at Mattress Farm. These were like 100 and... 150, 150 bucks for this, 200 bucks for this. Yeah. Not bad. Some of the places, when you first priced out the mattress, I it was... I was looking at like purple and Casper and Nectar. And it, was it was like, like $1,700. 1500 bucks. I'm <laughs> yeah. like, what are we doing here? I'm like, uh, let's see if yeah. we can find one a little cheaper. And this one is very comfortable as well. So we didn't sacrifice like comfort level yeah, for the price. Is, it's not a memory foam like those other ones are. Yeah. Or like grid pattern or something it doesn't come in a box it's like a regular mattress yeah, yeah this yeah. is what we grew up on yeah and look at me now look at how my back hurts <laughs> <laughs> it literally hurts so bad but uh he's a kid he's resilient yeah right. he'll be fine <laughs> <laughs> all right uh oh, oh no. you got it oh around the corner pivot you had to pivot pivot, pivot. 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 <laughs> my fajitas there we go. We're just gonna put it in the hallway for right now. But I also wanted to show you, check out Jackson's play area. We did some rearranging. Ooh, ooh. 
what, 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 show what? me. Okay. You guys want to know what I'm excited for? Yeah, show me. When the what? Show me what you're excited for. Oh no, I was gonna tell you. Oh, tell me. Uh, when the kids get older, yes, they're gonna be like into video games and M movies and maybe, stuff. Maybe, yeah. You know what this is gonna become? What? Like we're gonna turn into a theater. Oh, I think so. Yeah. Yeah, we'll like wall it off, right? Oh. Insulate it. Okay. Soundproof it. All right. Put in like a big old projector or something in there. Surround Ooh. sound. That'll be fun. Like at the houses that we stay at, at the like. I always want to call them, so Jackson calls them the fun houses. Yeah. And so anytime we, so I always call them the fun houses, but just so you guys know what I'm talking about, I'm talking about like the element vacation homes. Yeah. You know how they have like the Star Wars themed? Yeah, I don't know how to do a theme, right? I'm just going to put it in here. Oh, okay. You know what kind of couch I'm going to get? What? A sectional. Oh, because it has the speakers it's in the couch. Wireless. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Charge your phone. Charge your phones. It turns into like a, like a turns bed. It into like a giant bed. Yeah. Actually, I love that idea. It's going to be the cool house. <laughs> oh, wait, here, show me. Wait a minute. That idea. Oh, wrong finger. <laughs> and is it? <laughs> yes, it's, it's, it's the ring finger. No, they remember how they how they change it like this. It's just all all fingers out. Oh, yeah. Oh, they put all of this. We're talking about um. Rock Steven and Tyler. Yeah. yeah. He goes. Wait a minute. I love that idea. <laughs> yeah, still the wrong finger. <laughs> Ooh. So right before you were getting ready to leave, we got a box from Bush Gardens, right? And I know that Hallow's Cream is coming up, so. I'm assuming that there's gonna be Hello Scream stuff in this box. Let's see what's inside. Another box. Another box. <laughs> no. That's how they get you. Spooky. Oh, okay, yeah. Ooh. Gardens, look at that. Hello Scream. Oh, okay. There's a video for me to download. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh. Ooh, popcorn. Some popcorn. It says. Bagham's Buffalo and Blue Cheese Blend. Ooh, that sounds good. And it says, D.H. Bagham's Circus of Fear. Ooh. Spooky. Okay, so is, is Hallow Scream like clown themed this year? <laughs> spooky, spooky. What's this? What is it? Oh no, there's a picture of me. <gasps> and it just says next. Oh no. <laughs> I don't like the sound of that. This is a nice picture of me at Bush Gardens though. Oh yeah, right? What are they gonna do? What's what's Ooh. gonna happen? Ooh. September 8th through October 31st, you're next. Oh, I kinda love that. That was fun. My oh my, that's frightening. All right, so I was just bringing everything into the garage. I was just bringing in, this is our patio furniture from the front. The only plant that survived the summer. The rest are I just had to dump the pots out because all the plants had died. And then these are our fake plastic plants here. So these are looking good. All right, so some time has passed. We did go to the grocery store. I did finish, I didn't actually finish getting the stuff from outside. I actually, oh look who's here. Who's here now? This looks like crackers, but it's pita chips. They're pita chips, yeah, but they do look like crackers. Look at Jackson's cool shirt. Yeah, cause it like has a hold of crackers. It does? Mm -hmm. Whoa, I do see it. That's pretty awesome. I'm pretty sure that Nick, the theme park dad, gave you this shirt, buddy. Do you love it? Uh -huh. So wait, how was school today, buddy? One, two, three. Three pita chips, buddy. So that's something that I definitely noticed with school. A lot of the things I read about like having kids that are starting school is that after school, they will be like a little bit more, um, I don't know, like rambunctious or like wild because they are trying to keep their composure at school all day, <laughs> which is hard. And then they come home and they like let it all out. And I've definitely noticed that with Jackson. So it's been very interesting since he started school. It's been interesting to see. So wait, now Jackson, remember, what did I, what did I tell you I needed help with when we got home? Mm -hmm. I need you to help me get the cushions from outside because the mm -hmm. storm is coming. They did cancel school tomorrow. So we know that we're having a hurricane day. But I need you to help me get the cushions from outside so that we, so they don't blow away in the wind. We gotta put them in the garage. Can you help me? Yeah. Okay, cool, I gotta help her. Oh, another thing, another thing I meant to tell you guys is that when we were picking Jackson up from school, who did you FaceTime? Did you, did you FaceTime Daddy when we were driving home from school? Mm -hmm. Where was Daddy? Do you remember? Seven Dwarves Mine Train. He was riding the Seven Dwarves Mine Train when we FaceTimed him. Um, I'll put the picture in right here. Are you all done? Mm. Yeah. I'll put the picture in right here so you can see it. But it was really funny. He, he, I gave him my phone and he's like, I want to FaceTime daddy. And then when we did, 
Daddy was on a roller coaster and it was pretty funny. Right, bud? Pretty over. <laughs> um, so yeah, so we're gonna go get the stuff. Oh, thank you, buddy. We're gonna go get the stuff from outside and put it in the garage to get ready for the storm. You wanna help me? Yeah. Okay, cool, thank you. We'll be right back. Okay, it's a little bit later. Again, sorry, I didn't show you outside. I did take Jackson with me. We went outside, we grabbed all the stuff. My hair still looks crazy, sorry. <laughs> that never changed. Uh, but we got everything from outside. I will show you like a quick pan around of how everything looks. Oh, I have to get the bar stools. I didn't get the bar stools, I'll do that. But I am making dinner now because the weather, I believe, is starting. So it doesn't look windy right now, but a second ago, it was super windy outside. So I believe something's happening. So I'm gonna, <gasps> hi buddy. So while this little guy is okay in his activity chair, I'm getting dinner ready. I'm gonna just like broil up some, I was gonna grill these. I was gonna do more veggie skewers because I loved them so much, but the weather's a little funky. So I'm just gonna do these in the, um, in the oven. And then I've got some chicken thighs marinating. I'm gonna put some barbecue sauce on those after they're cooked, but I think this is gonna be delicious. It's just a little red onion, squash, zucchini, bell pepper, tomato. Looks pretty good. And this guy, he's been helping me cook. He's been playing some cool tunes for me. Do, 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 right? Yeah. Do, 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 hi. But I, I feel like after dinner, I'm gonna end this video because I think we're gonna start the hurricane video after dinner. So I'm gonna make dinner. That'll be the end of it. Oh, and then, oh, maybe I'll show you. So we wanted to put Jackson's big boy bed together because like we showed you earlier, the mattress did come, but I think that'll be in tomorrow's hurricane vlog video or the next, maybe not tomorrow, but the next home vlog will be the hurricane vlog. And I think it'll be in that video. I don't know why it doesn't focus on my face. It focuses on this box behind me. I don't know what that's all about, but I'll be right back. I'm gonna put some stuff in the oven. It's a chubby oven. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Oliver, Oliver loves Jackson so much. Whoa! You got very dizzy. Are you okay? I got very dizzy. He thinks Jackson is so funny. He loves you so much. What are you doing, babes? It's Big Brother being so. <laughs> Well, what was that, babes? <laughs> so, dinner is ready. I've got my, my chicken is done, my veggies are, are broiled, my rice, and then, Jackson's is almost done, I'm just, his chicken is being cooked right now. He's gonna have just regular, regular chicky nugs. Whoa, all right, so, I'll see you in just one second when we get to the table. All right, you're, you're down, you're eating your Denny's? I did it. What do you think? Good. The first thing he said, he goes, that's a lot of rice. Yeah, that's a lot of rice. <laughs> I get it. Yeah. You did. He tried some of my veggies, even though he didn't love them, but he tried them and I was very proud of him. So, I don't know. I thought this was pretty good. We were going to grill. I can't remember if I said this or not, but we were going to grill all of this and then we just got away from us because the weather was looking a little hairy out there and now it's kind of fine. So, I don't know what's gonna happen tonight. It's supposed to hit us in like the early morning? 3 a.m. 3 a.m., okay. Well, I mean, this is it hitting us right now. Oh, okay. But. Right. Well, here's what we'll do is we're gonna end this video now and then we'll pick up here and we'll let you know how the hurricane goes, okay? All right, where do we leave off? Dinner. Dinner? Yeah. Dinner was delicious. Yeah, it was really, it turned out great. A lot of rice. <laughs> I also something that I realized because I just finished editing the rest of this video you know those pencils I bought the colorful ones yeah for children they're for okay. children that are just starting to learn how to ha like handwriting totally fine so I think they're Jackson's pencils now <laughs> I might use them they're they're the lead was very thick yeah. and the pencil itself was also very thick only time I ever use pencils is when I'm doing work around the house they would work for that, so yeah. I might, I might take those. Okay. Those are not my pens. All right. But uh, they, they are cool. Oh. Yeah, they're not regular pencils. They're cool pencils. Oh, yeah, like a cool ball. So, um, all right. So we're going to go to bed. We are, we're cleaning up after dinner. Dinner was, um, was very good. Like, it was a mess, yeah, but it was very good. And I love just, like, roasted veggies. Yeah, Grilled really veggies. Good. Yeah, so delicious. I can't wait to use the grill again. Yeah. Today just wasn't a great day for it. But right now, what's happening? 
Let's go look outside real quick. Oh yeah, all right, here it is. Nothing. A slight breeze. Actually feels good out here. Feels very nice out here. Yeah. What's the temperature out right now? 76. Yeah, this is great. Beautiful. Granted, it probably will get worse later on, like earlier this morning, like tomorrow morning. Yeah, but 3 a.m. Right now, nothing. Amazing. A whole lot of nothing. Yeah. I don't know if we're gonna bring the bar stools inside. I didn't do that yet. Should we do it? Yeah, we'll do it real quick. Okay, yeah, maybe we should. All right, and I, I think that's gonna be it for us. I think so. There it is. The trees. There's like the littlest, tiniest bit of wind. A little wind, bit of movement to them. But that's about it. You can kind of hear it, listen. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, well, there it goes. Ooh. It feels so nice out here. I can't get over it. All right, we're back inside. <laughs> I think what we'll do though for tomorrow's video, the one that you're gonna see, I feel like we're gonna have a hurricane, like a Disney hurricane prep video first and then the hurricane home vlog. Right. I don't really know if it's gonna be a true hurricane home vlog though. Right, well the, the hurricane prep video was not a true hurricane prep video. I brought stuff inside. No, no, oh, the Disney one. Oh, right, 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 yeah, because spoiler alert, they didn't, Disney didn't do anything to prep while you were there. Right. Who knows, maybe they did something later when you left. I did see two pictures from Epcot, one where they took down some flags and another one where they strapped down one thing. Oh, okay, well. That's it. <laughs> so, we're gonna go to bed. Uh, if anything wild happens well, in the middle of the night. Let's get up at three, because it's supposed to happen at three, right? Well, I, that was an estimate. Oh, by who? The, the, I don't know, the weather guy. But oh. like, you can't, there's no, Storms don't have like a, it's not like a... Well, I'm just saying, let's get up and we'll start like to... catching the train. We'll start the video in the middle of the night to show you like what's going on outside. Okay. Because I want to show them. All right. We always sleep through it. Yeah, that's why I like sleeping. <laughs> it's nice. Well, okay, maybe we'll show you. Okay. I guess we'll just have to tune in and see if we show you. Right? But yeah, but today's video was, was still fun. I had fun. Did you tell them that Jackson's school got canceled tomorrow? Yes. Okay. Yeah. So, so. It'll be a fun day at home. Yeah, I think we're just going to hang out and we have, we're going to put his big boy bed together. I'm so excited for that. He's yeah. so excited. I'm so excited. He's a big boy. Right? Yeah. And then they got to see, you weren't here for this, but they got to see Jackson and Oliver. Like, like Oliver loves Jackson. I know yeah. you know this, you know this, but like, it was so cute. It's so cute to watch Oliver's reaction to Jackson. Right. He absolutely like adores him. It's my favorite thing. They love each so, other. I'm glad. Oh yeah, no, Jackson, you can tell Jackson like loves Oliver too, but Oliver absolutely loves his big brother. And it's, it's That's so, exciting. I know I'm glad we got to like share it with you guys. Um, cause we see it every day. So it was very cute. Yeah. But, uh, but yeah, today was a lot of fun. Thanks for hanging out with us and thanks for letting us do these home vlogs. I love them. I miss them. So it's a good time. Yeah. We spent a lot of 2020 doing these type of videos. I know. It's so, I was thinking about that actually, is that we don't have a lot of Oliver, like we don't have a lot of his, like we personally have a lot of like videos and pictures and stuff of him because we just take them personally, like for ourselves. But because we were stuck, we were all isolating when Jackson was Oliver's age. Yeah. We have so much like documented of him. Right. And Oliver's a little bit different. I know. Yeah, the so world's a little bit different. The world is different, yeah. But but yeah, so I'm just happy to be doing home vlogs. I love it. I love hanging out with you guys at home and love hanging out with you at home. And Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. It's fun. Also, fun for me. this is like the calm before the storm because September, ooh, buddy. Yeah, there's so much going on. So get ready. It's like the Halloween season ramps up in September. Hold on to your butts. Hold on to your spooky butts. Oh, there you go. <laughs> So all in all, it was a fantastic day. Yeah. With that being said, we are off. We'll see you all tomorrow. And now, now it's time, time to, to pay, pay the, the price. price.